Okay, so let's go and force a power down on this uh, Samsung Galaxy A42 to perform any hard reset in case it's asking a password pattern or pin to power down the phone. Okay, so with the phone, uh, with the screen on, you're going to press and hold volume down and power key for um, uh, as soon as the, uh, the icons appears, I'm going to count 1 to 10 seconds. And then after 10 seconds, uh, I'm going to switch uh release volume down and gonna press volume up and then um you're gonna go from there okay and as soon as the um recovery menu appears i'm gonna release volume up okay so now let's go really quick and just follow me or watch the video first when well, volume down and power key okay here okay okay volume down and power one two three four five six seven eight nine ten i'm gonna switch to volume up wait for the phone to vibrate and i'm gonna release the power key okay release the power key continue holding volume up okay release volume up okay so now we are on the recovery menu gonna use the volume down to highlight wipe data factory reset and now press the power key to confirm or okay next step it's uh, using volume down uh, i wanna highlight res um, reset factory data reset factory data reset something like that okay um so here is very very important to talk about what's going on with this process is basically it's a factory reset so everything stored in your phone is going to be deleted okay so such as pictures videos contacts and um, downloaded applications and things like that but with the same uh, google account associated with the phone now uh, you will be able to retrieve all these all of those um, uh, multimedias as far as you did a backup reset so and if you have a external memory card, go ahead and remove it so uh, you can save any uh, files that you have stored on that external memory card. Okay, so now if you are ready to do this, uh, press the power key once the um, reset factory data reset or restablecer configuration de fabrica as you see on the uh, video, press the power key right uh, next step is reboot system now is highlighted automatically so just press the power key to confirm and now here the phone will start to reboot and start the factory reset it's going to take some eight minutes okay so just uh, be patient uh, in case it take more than eight to ten minutes so it take more than ten minutes that means that something is wrong with the phone um perform the same process such as long press the power key to uh, power down the phone and now you're gonna start uh, pressing volume up and power key with the phone off uh, and as soon as the phone vibrates or the Samsung logo appears release only the power key continue holding volume up and when you see the recovery menu with blue blue letters that you we saw at the beginning of the video, release the volume key. In case that uh, your phone completely reboots when you press the volume, I mean power down, power key, and then uh, you have to do the same process that we did at the beginning of the video. Okay, so and so we can um. When that happens, the, the phone freezes, then something is wrong with the uh, process processor. processor. So, uh, by doing uh, or repeating the same process up to 10 to 20 times, uh, comments in my videos, uh, my, well, the, the, my users, they, they, they said that uh, repeating up to 20 times have solved their problem. So, Maybe it's something that you would like to do as well. Okay, so uh, just let me know in a comment if you have any questions. It's going to take up to five minutes. So just like I said, be patient. Let's wait for the phone to work itself. And then you want to return, come back and uh, get to the initial setup screen. 
and, and step by steps to get to the home screen okay so uh, right here we have we are on the initial setup screen and these are the languages that you can use on your samsung galaxy a42 5g select your favorite language and then hit ok uh, touch the start button and i have written agree to all these above hit the next button and now you can go ahead and register a wi-fi or insert your active active and sim card from your carrier I'm gonna skip this step for now. I'm gonna skip it anyway because I don't have anything registered on the phone yet. Um, next step, copy your data. This is where uh, you can enter your um, previous email address registered on this phone. So you can download any applications uh, you have purchased before or uh, register a new one. Okay, so now for, for now, I'm gonna touch on copy. Right, so you can manually enter your um, time zone, uh, date and time, I mean date, select the month right here, select the day and hit OK, the hour, this is the hour, minutes, AM or PM, and hit OK to save, and now hit at the bottom of the screen, next. Okay, I highly recommend, highly recommend you to leave a... Uh, everything on on google account services because it's important that anything that you go on google to search from your phone the first result that you're gonna get is the one on your according to your phone's location and also if there is any update for your android they're gonna notify you by email and you will be able to download the update okay so uh, let's go and touch accept Okay, you can lock your screen with password, pattern, or pin, fingerprints, or face recognition. You can do it now, or you can do it once you get to the uh, main screen, and you can go to settings, security, and uh, do that. Okay, you're going to skip this step for now. Okay, recommended apps. I, myself, I don't like this, my sites, okay? It's very, very... I don't like it but you can keep the weather okay you can keep the weather i want to keep the weather i like the weather so hit, uh, now hit next to continue <laughs> all right samsung account you can um uh, you can uh, create a samsung account here or register an existing one or uh, you can do this one also on home screen it's gonna skip this i'm gonna skip it and track phone terms and conditions accept and continue and you are all set up okay so uh, thanks so much for um, your um, choosing my video uh, please subscribe uh, to the channel just in case that you need another help in the future or another help with this device the samsung galaxy a42 uh, and uh, let me know if you have any other question and keep in touch thanks so much